In the previous video, you learned how to send a select command from Python to MySQL. In this video, we will be talking about how do I send an insert command, a delete command, or an update command, that is any of my DML commands from Python to MySQL. Okay, but before that, let me just tell you that in MySQL, I have a database named as company. And in the database named as company, I have a table called EMP, and this is my table. So I'll be working on this table through Python. Is that clear? Okay, so let me just come to my spider IDE. Uh, now I think I don't need to explain the first three lines to you because you know these are the lines that I need to write if I have to issue or get connected from Python to MySQL and issue a SQL command. Okay, so now first let me teach you what if I wanted to insert a new record into table EMP. Okay, so what will I write? So I am going to be using a variable called SQL which will basically be storing my SQL command. Now, for those of you who are not familiar with SQL commands, I would suggest that you familiarize yourself with the insert, delete, and update command of MySQL before you actually look into this video. Is that clear? So how do I write something? Uh, I mean, insert something into a, a SQL table or a MySQL table? You write insert into, and the name of the table, the name of the table is EMP. Then you write the keyword values. And in bracket, you specify the list, list of values. So I'm writing 106, comma, I need to give the name of the person. The name of the person is going to be, let's say, Raj. And then I need to give the salary of the person. Let's say salary of the person is going to be 650. Then I need to give the, what was it in my table? The department of the person, the department of the person is, let's say, sales. And then I need to give the, uh, what, the designation of the person. Okay, let me call him a manager. Okay, so these, now the order that you write here should be the order that you have maintained in your SQL command. Okay, and I finished. This is my uh, SQL insert command. Okay, now did you see that I've written Raj sales manager in single quotes? We have learned that we could write single quotes or double quotes, but I'm purposely not using a double quotes here is because in Python, I have started the string here. Can you see I've started it with a double quotes? So the minute I put double quotes here, it'll assume it's the end of that string. So just not to create a confusion, I have put single quotes instead of double quotes. Is that clear? So my command is here. How do I send a command uh, across I mean, from Py, uh, my, uh, Python to MySQL, we make use of the execute function using the cursor object. So what's my cursor object? My cursor dot execute. And what is the command I want to execute? I've stored it in a variable called SQL. In my previous video, I have told you, you could have typed the entire insert command in this parameter. You know, just to make it easier, I mean, or easier to understand, I've put the command in a variable and I'm just using the variable. Okay, now in this scenario, remember, I'm not going to be getting any answer back. You've seen in MySQL, if I issue an insert command, there is no answer coming back to me. Okay, but I want this to be done permanently. So I need to be issuing another statement here, which says the connection object, which is my connection dot commit. So this is going to be making the changes that I'm trying to do permanent in my EMP table. Is that clear? Okay. And generally, when you finish with what you have to do, it's always better, like my last option in the previous video, it said, clean up your environment. And how do you clean up your environment? By writing my connection dot close. Okay. So what would this do previously? The connect function here is setting up a connection between Python and MySQL. My connection dot close will, you know, close that connection and, you know, it will clean up all the memory that I've been using and things like that. Is that clear? So let's just execute this program. Now, do you expect to see an answer here? Actually, no. Let me just execute the program for you. Okay, so the program is being executed. And remember, there will always be a slight delay. Did you see? That's because I am not just in Python. I'm sending this from Python to MySQL, which is another application altogether. So there will be a delay. But I don't see any answer here because there is no print statement in my program. Then how do I check 
whether this insert has taken place or no. We have our, you know, MySQL uh, command client here. Let me just issue the select star from EMP. So currently, can you see from 101 to 105, I'm going to be seeing whether the new record got added. Can you see Raj's record got added here? So what does it mean that the insert command has worked? Is that clear? Okay. What if it was an update command? Okay. What if it was an update command? So let's just have a look at somebody's record. Okay. I'm going to update Tara's salary. Can you see Tara's salary is 600? Okay. I'm going to update her salary. Okay. So what is our update command of MySQL? How do you write an update command of MySQL? You write update the name of the table. That's EMP set the column that you want to update. What do you want to update? Salary. Okay. Now, do you want to give an increase, decrease, or just directly change to a new value? I'm directly changing to a new value. I'm saying 750. Okay. And for whom do I want to say this? Where? I can say where uh, EMPNO is equal to 101. Okay. Tara's employee number, do you remember, was 101. So update EMP, set Tara's salary to 750. Now I'm going to execute this command once again. Okay. After execution, how do I check? Because there's no print here. How do I check whether this has happened? Let's go to MySQL once again and let me issue the select uh, command. Can you see Tara's salary has changed to 750? So which means what? My update command, which I sent from Python to MySQL has worked. Is that clear? Okay. What if I want to delete a record? Okay. So if I want to delete a record, what is the command for deleting a record? We have been writing is delete from and the name of the table that's EMP where and a condition. So suppose I want to delete uh, the last record that I in inserted. So what is the last records employee number uh, 106. So I write where EMP NO is equal to 106. Okay, so let me just execute the command. I mean, execute the program. It's done there and I'm not expecting to see Raj again. Can you see Raj has been deleted? So very simple. You just need to know the connection lines. That means how do you connect Python to um, MySQL? And then issuing the SQL command is same like the SQL commands that we have learned in MySQL. Is that clear? Okay. 